Chi Baba. Welcome everyone to another exciting episode of Let's Play. I'm Bobby F. J. Town, your host, and we're going to jump right into it and let's talk about what we played. Sword, what would you play this week and how are you doing? I'm doing great, Bobby. I played a lot of mobile games, a little bit of Stealth Bastard Deluxe on my Android tablet, uh, a lot of Angry Birds friends, uh, touching on a lot of the mobile games, but forget all that because, oh my god, I played Call of Duty Ghosts. Wait, hold on. You can't, uh, uh, go ahead. Never mind. I forgot who I was listening to. <laughs> uh, Bobby? We get along so great. Right. Uh, Chachi, what'd you play? I'm doing How well, Bobby. How are you, How are you doing? Asking? Um, <laughs> well, not only did I play, but I beat Assassin's Creed 4 in 30 hours. Yeah. Um, nice. Despite the internet saying that it only takes 20, which is a damn lie. It's an outrageous lie. Um, they had days uh, it, it, It's... I, I don't know how to put it. it it's an amazing game. Um, I wrote a non-spoiler-filled and a spoiler-filled review um, for Insert Coin, so I suggest you go check it out. Um, and I have to say, a, a non-spoiler-filled review of anything is probably the hardest thing that you can do. That's why they're professionals. Because <laughs> exactly. I, I, I had to, I had to write a post uh, that had content and readability, and not give anything away. Mm -hmm. um, so, it, but I did it. Um, I got approval because I had Sword read it before I posted it to make sure I wasn't posting crap. <laughs> and, uh, and and speaking of posting crap, Game Informer, get your shit together. <laughs> That's all I have to say. I Honestly, I was so pissed off yesterday because one of the writers it took the time to write a five-paragraph story that I wasted the time reading to say that he wasn't playing Assassin's Creed 4 because it's pirates and he doesn't like pirates. What? Wow. How, how He's really, like really pirates? hurting to get his assignment in that day, wasn't he? I, 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 so It was so irritating. You know what? I, 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 it's the internet and everyone's allowed their opinion, but if, you, if that's all you really want to say, use Twitter. Yeah, I don't, no, don't want to play don't. Assassin's Creed 4 because it has pirates in it. Under yeah. 140 characters. Right. Um, and I also played uh, Ghosts. <laughs> All right. Uh, Riz, what did you play and how are you doing? I'm doing fantastic. How are you doing, Bobby? I'm doing great, too. Doing good? Getting ready mm -hmm. for Saturday? Yeah, getting ready for Saturday, our big All right. day. Uh, that's great. That's great. That's perfect. Um, how, how's everybody? How's everybody over there in Johnstown, Bobby? Good, good. Just get to your games. Wow. All right. <laughs> Are we an amateur podcast here? <laughs> I've strapped for time. I have been playing uh, WWE 14. I am on the final boss. What? Yep. <laughs> you heard me right. Are you, are you fighting warts? Final. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you have to throw radishes in his mouth? <laughs> yes. Uh, but, and I've also beaten The Undertaker already. And I'm actually going to uh, do something right now. If you go on insertcointobegin.com, that little thing on the side there, where it has our, you know, meter of cash that we have donated to mm -hmm. uh, the Pittsburgh... Children's Hospital. We are up to five hundred and sixty dollars so far, but there's still mm -hmm. room to grow. There's still room to grow, and I'm going to make that grow right now. If you go on there and click on my name and donate twenty five dollars, I will not only play WWE fourteen and play the streak again. I can't believe I'm doing this. You. I will play legendary, beat the streak, until I beat him. <laughs> and I will use your character in the description. Ooh. Sack Rider. 
So I just got to drop 25 bucks in for you to do all of that, huh? All of that. What happened to the other thing you said about, too, if they donate $50? No. You're going to examine lemons all day. <laughs> I'm going to examine lemons <laughs> for 24 hours. Yeah, that's funny. Examine lemons in uh, Riz's favorite game is LA Noir, by the way. And he said if you uh, donate fifty dollars to him, he will play LA Noir for an hour. And oh. I will poke my and eyes. Since he out doesn't have there. the game, I will mail him my copy of the game. Why do you have a copy of that game, Bobby? Because I have it. I don't mind it. You should burn it. <laughs> I could burn it and give you a copy of it. If hey, Bobby. <laughs> yes. How are you, sir, and what did you play? I am good. Um, I played this week. I played Avengers Alliance, of course, uh, trying to get Hemdall and um, uh, Loki. I uh, played Pokemon X. I uh, played NHL 14. Um, oh, I, pl I played Goats, too. I didn't play Ghost yet because mine is still coming from Amazon. Who played Goats? I, I played Goats. Goats. <laughs> Call of Duty Goats. Goats is, <laughs> Goats is a really good game. And uh, I downloaded it, it, Minecraft. And I played the challenge this week, which was Lion King. Uh -huh. Did anybody else play the challenge? Oh, I'm sorry. I was busy Crickets. beating Assassin's Creed 4. Why do we have challenges if I'm the only one that plays them every week? Whoa, 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 whoa. Did Hold you on. play the challenge, Riz? No. no. <laughs> but first of all, remember the beginning of, of the – when the show first started? Yes. Who was the only one who didn't play the challenges? Me. Bobby. <laughs> so you guys are making up for it's it with payback, me. Payback, Bobby. Okay. Well, okay. That's fair. Um, but do you guys have any memories of The Lion King? Let's let's ask that question. Uh, not Paled in comparison to Aladdin, I remember. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It wasn't as good. Um, it was fine. It was still good. It was okay. Hey, Bobby. It wasn't Aladdin. Doing Probably it. harder yeah. than it needed to be. Can I interrupt you for a second? Okay. Um... I would like to point out that you have played 211 hours <laughs> wow. no, so of sorry. Avengers Alliance. I, I thing? have no life. The closest oh. to you is Riz Hi. at at five hours. Wait, 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 wait. Of, of, of people who, who aren't on Raptor. Out of the people who are on Raptor, I am the, have the most invested. But there are other people in our friend circle that have more time invested in Alliance than I do. Oh, no. really? Yes. No. no. Yes, there are. There has to be. No. He's on, he's on a higher level than me. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Maybe he's just he's better at it than at you are. He's 200. He buys Dude, Mike? Stuff. Yes. I would also like to point out that Mike spent time completing Lego Marvel. Uh, 100%. Well, yeah, that's good for him. Already? What's the last game you beat, Bobby? The last game I beat? Yeah. Um, I would have 100%. to think about it. <laughs> think about it. I would have to think about it. I, let me get back to you on that. Did you, did, did you beat Am GTA I, yet, Bobby? Huh? Did you beat GTA yet? Not yet. I'm still playing through it. How about goats? No, I didn't get that yet. <laughs> I keep thinking you're saying goats. <laughs> He is saying goats. <laughs> I don't okay, know what you're Bobby, talking about. Uh, I'm, Bobby, I'm talking yes. about GT, uh, Call of Duty Ghosts. Doors. Oh, you know what? Dorm. You know what it was? Bioshock Infinite. It was the last game I beat. Wow. Which came out Bobby. when, Bobby? Which came out March. I don't finish games. I, I don't want them to end. Bobby. I don't like to see <laughs> endings of games. Everything has to end sometimes. I know, but... Okay, Bobby. Bobby, yes. I have a challenge for you during your uh, 25 hours. Oh, I will game beat marathon. a game during the challenge. Uh, I want you to beat a game. Thing. I will beat a game. I promise you I will beat a game. I don't care what game. Pick it. I just want you to beat a game. I want you NHL to... 2014, I will beat the Flyers. No, I, I want you <laughs> to beat a game that has an ending. Okay, I will. If I do that, will you donate money? No. Aw, oh, damn it. I, I have my reasons that we will not go into right now. Okay. Let's get into some stories. Yeah. Let's go to our what you should be made aware of this week and what games are coming out. Uh, all, all, of course, one that we've been talking about already, 
uh, in length tonight. Uh, Call of Duty Ghosts, not Goats, Ghosts come up, come out today. That's what I've been um, saying. <laughs> uh, ben 10 Omniverse. You guys are thinking I'm saying Goats when I'm saying Goats. Goats. That's, ex that's exactly <laughs> what like I'm saying. saying goats. <laughs> oh, my. This show is great so far. <laughs> Keep going, Bobby. Uh, but anyways, we, uh, Ben 10 Omniverse is, is out today. Um, Power Rangers Mega Force for the 3DS. And Castlevania Lords of Shadow Collection. Um, there are a couple other games that, eh, they're whatever. So more Zumba games. Everybody, there's, yeah, there's more Zumba again. Yeah, um, more Zumba games. So everybody just that, kind so. of stepped out of the way this week yeah, for Call of Duty. Yeah, apparently, much. they're like, mm, yeah, yeah. It feels yeah, like think, everybody else is just like not paying attention. I think the next, well, well, next, well, not next week, but the the week after, uh, that's when the big systems come out. So yeah, I think everybody's trying to save their. Debuts for that week. Yeah. So, um, and uh, another thing you should be made aware of, um, Riz, I think you wrote a story on the iFruit for Android for yep. Grand Theft Auto Five. Okay. Uh, raise of hands. Who beat the game already? I did. I'm close. Good. Good. Guess what came out for Android that you kind of have to have, kind of. If you want it to complete chops thing, the iFruit. Uh huh. So that means if you bought the game and you have an Android app and you didn't beat the game yet, like the one part, uh, one person in this group right now, Bobby, yeah. you have a chance. To train Chomp. So you have to beat the game in order to train Chomp? No. Oh. It's it, 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 I, like I am. I, I was fine when it it came out. Of course, everybody was fine when that came out. Uh, but I was fine when there all the bugs were happening in GTA Online. Mm -hmm. I was okay with you know changing my character over and over again because of the down system and. All that stuff. But I've beaten the game already. I'm not going to buy an app. What's free? For an online... It's free. I mean, I'm not going to get an app on my phone to train a dog, a virtual dog, and make vanity license plates. Yeah, but you can break, focus on your rims, too. Because well, right now, that's all you can do. Here, here's my thing, okay? And, it's, and since we're on the topic, let me just state: and uh, not every game needs an app. Nope. Okay. Um, GTA Five? No, you don't need an app. Um, Assassin's Creed Four? No. Shouldn't have an app. Do they have one? Yeah. They do. What does it do? Um, it allows you to control your fleet. Um, think of Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, where you could send other assassins out on missions. Um, you can send other boats out on missions, um, which you can do and should do in the game. Okay. Um, but uh, Call of Duty Ghosts has an app. Goats. They're just using Don't the need it. they're just using the Alita app again, right? No, this is a whole different app. Oh, what? Wow. And it, and I refuse to download it. But uh, the, according to the the paper just inside, plays, just plays Eminem survival on constantly. It, it allows <laughs> you to uh, compete in clan wars. Um, no, maybe you do need it. Uh, you can mo you can uh, use it as a second screen for multiplayer, mm -hmm. but I don't see that working very well. I'll yeah. test it. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll test it too. I can use right. any help I can get in multiplayer. <laughs> um, and you can manage your clan. 
So uh, basically the same stuff that you can do in Assassin's Creed 4, it's just not needed. It's not needed. I mean, none of, none of this is required or anything, but these are all extensions. They're trying to do more to bring you into the game. Is that really a problem? Uh, there, it, yes. <laughs> why, why are we upset about things that we don't have to use to complete the experience? These are extensions. Oh, we're not upset experience. about it. No, 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 no. I'm not upset about this game, about the, the iFruit coming to Come, being a thing the part I'm mad about is for the iPhone users they already have it they already yeah, they had, had it for day they one, had it at launch okay and they get, they already used it they already done it they already have it they already did whatever it is Android users now just got it okay and everybody I know except for Bobby has beaten this game. Well, I, so I it's still think kind of a pointless app. I think that's uh, the, I think that's a low percentage of people have probably already beaten the game. Out of the record-breaking people that bought it, there are probably people that will get on this now on Android devices and be just perfectly fine with that. I know it's annoying, but you're like the weird one percent. Like uh, I am a weird one percenter sort. Yes. Uh, listen, but, listen. That's because you're a one percenter. Who beat a game in a ridiculous amount of time and happened to have an Android device? Wait, so I'm getting punished because I don't. Yeah, I, we're being I, punished good, because we don't I, have an I, iPhone. I'm being punished be because back. I'm a good gamer. <laughs> because yes, GTA Rockstar. Let's not forget Rockstar put this game out, and then two weeks later put in the online mode. Yeah. Saying that if you beat this, you were, you're you probably going to beat this game in two weeks. They gave us two weeks to beat the story mode. Except for mm -hmm. me. Except for Bobby. He needs more. And it's not most that I need more. It's just I haven't this gotten game. back to it yet. Am I, am I not wrong on that one? The silence... The silence is making me so happy because I'm right. Anyways, I'm not going to download it. I don't have any use for it. The only thing the only thing that I ever downloaded for a game was uh, was Mass Effect and their database that they had. Mm -hmm. And that was like a one-time thing that I downloaded for my iPhone. Um and it was kind of cool because it did have like the thing for the missions and crap like that. But it also had like different emails that you can have from when you finish a mission. It goes towards like what other people in your clan are saying about it. Mm -hmm. I downloaded so it, it was for... it was kind of cool like that, and I wish it was more. I wish the, the iFruit app was more like that mm -hmm. and had more of a personal feel to it. This feels like it, it, this feels like it's an extra little thing uh, that like they a, added. Like, like an Easter egg. This, this, yeah, it feels like it's like a 10% project some of the developers did uh, in the course of this. This is, uh, you know, as opposed to what looks That's, like what Call of Duty is doing where they're like, no, we really want to enhance your experience with this thing. Um, I mean, this this seems like just kind of a goofy little thing in comparison. Um, I I'd like the Call of Duty Elite up until now, at least so far with the uh, Modern Warfare Three and Black Ops Two. I like that I can go in there and see exactly how bad I'm sucking at multiplayer. Um, and, 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 Elite oh, and, is a. Oh, go ahead, Chachi. I didn't mean to interrupt you, sir. Uh, Elite is a useful app. Yeah. Uh, that has a purpose. Yeah, it's a it's a nice place to go and 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 see how am I doing, you know, and analyze that stuff and I could go in go in and look at the weapons and everything when I'm not at my console. I mean, for the you know really kind of addicted you know people to the game, it's a it's a way for them not to have to leave it all the time, you know. And those are the people that are probably are usually whooping my ass are the ones that are looking at that and figuring out all that kind of stuff and watching Call of Duty TV and all that kind of stuff. I, I'm just glad it's not. They're not making you pay for it like they did the first year, so oh, that was rough. I I remember um downloading do, downloading an app or like a game on my Chrome browser uh, for Dragon Age Two, which I beat. Um, I just wanted to mention that that the 
I beat that game. Um, but <laughs> but it, it let you unlock uh, different pieces of armor and weapons and stuff like that. And st- if you're going to do something like that, that's a cool feature, I think. Mm-hmm. If, it, if you unlock stuff within the game. Um, but yeah, if, if it has no use, what, what's the point? Yeah. So. Okay. All right. Uh, we're going to move on to our new segment. Um, EA has officially dropped Tiger Woods starting next year from their PGA games. Um, it's not going to be Tiger Woods. Uh, uh, he's, it's not going to okay. bear his name anymore, basically. Um, Riz, I think you wrote this story, so uh, do you want to take I, it? I don't get it. I don't get it from EA's standpoint. Uh, you have a new generation of game consoles coming out. Mm-hmm. And you need you need name it you need a name to be on that cover. Do you? You're saying? Yeah. Are, are you going to pick up PGA Tour well, for you know the Xbox One or PlayStation Four or Sword? No. If I really want to play a golf game, I'll just plug in my Wii. <laughs> I would play Lee Trevino Fighting Golf, but <laughs> which but is one of the best just, arcade games of all time. Not, it, it, the graphics are good. I, I posted a uh, a comparison on the insert coin to begin post that I had on there. You can the see the, the the new new gen graphics on top. The and screenshot the, is beautiful. The current current gens on the bottom, uh, and they have great graphics. Mm-hmm. But if there's no, I, I think if there's no name recognition on there, and if yeah. there's because everybody, do you know who Tiger Woods is? Yes, but do you you also know that Tiger Woods plays in the PGA Tour? Do you know who Tiger? Do you know anybody else who plays on the PGA Tour? Yeah, couple people. Name one. Greg Norman. Greg Norman. Yeah. Greg Name Norman, another the old guy. Uh, VJ Singh. Okay. Okay. Well, I, I, yeah, I think I think what you, well, he's trying to get at, it. like, who else is there that has crossover yeah, appeal like Tiger Woods? Everybody knows who Tiger Woods is. Um, you not, can't the problem, have but the, the name, yeah, Twitter, yeah. But NHL you know. doesn't need. Uh, yeah, hey, oh, they they call they it NHL. Cover boys. Did they, uh, they Riz, Did they give a reason for him being dropped? Like, did they say anything? Uh, they he likes did to have, not. He likes to have <laughs> sex <laughs> with uh, waitresses. And like that alone, I'm surprised. I, I'm surprised they didn't drop him I, already. Um, and on yeah, top of, if they think they that. can still sell PGA Tour based on the merits of being an EA sports property alone, um, Maybe then his got- why pay him all this money if they don't think you know? But with his damage re- damage reputation, they're going to sell more games. Then why not say, okay, we don't need you. Goodbye. You know, it's a PGA Tour. Uh, we're EA Sports. We'll sell these hand over fist anyways. Have Maybe they done Ellen that with Madden? That. Maybe Ellen got that in the divorce. Oh, uh, Madden. Rights. I don't, well, has, has Madden done anything to warrant that? And is Madden really getting as much money as Tiger Woods? Probably. He has been doing this for 25 years, sort of. I bet you most of the people that pick up Madden today, like half of them, one of the one, first of all, they're so young, they probably don't know who the fuck Madden is in, to begin with. Yeah, exactly. He doesn't really grace the game that much anymore, does he? No, not so, at all, no. actually. He's just on the, the name. He's not even on the cover, anything. It's just basically, known as Madden. Basically, they pay for the name Madden so people know what it is every every year. It separates them, although like you really can't separate them because it's the only NFL game in town. But so. like the NFL, they could they could call it NFL 2014 and people would buy it. Yeah, you know, I don't think eh. the name matters anymore. Eh. I, I still think that that if you have the best golfer in the world today, but he's really not the best anymore. He's, he's on everything as, uh, well you see about golf, is he not? He's huh? doing the car commercial still. He still has all the money. Damn. He may be doing things in Waffle House, but he's getting paid to do it. Uh, but, <laughs> but doing things in Waffle House. That houses. new generation of consoles. <laughs> you need that face. You need the fist pump. You need everything that Tiger Woods brings. 
Now, am I offended that he's not in this game? He's a, he's a jerk. But I still think they do need something. No, Tiger Woods doesn't to make our podcast. To make his game, to make the game good. They need people to go flock to the game. It's not Madden. They're not going to have people like, uh, I'm going to throw out a name here, John Daly on the cover. That's Cause another nobody, one. Because nobody wants to know John Daly has a video game. John Daly also has a podcast, but it's a different guy entirely. That, yeah, it's a different, that's a different John Daly. Uh, but Tiger Woods would make that make that guy look at that look at that uh, game and see the graphics and want to try it out. Am I correct? Yeah. What about Happy Gilmore? If they put Happy Gilmore in the cover. That's a fictional character, Bobby. So is John Madden right now. Basically. That is a good point. So, all right. Well, we're going to move on. Uh, good discussion on that. Um, Assassin's Creed 4 came out last week, and uh, Chachi played through it. Chachi, do you have any thoughts on the game? Uh, yes, I do. Yar. Um, I, I wrote them down. It's an amazing game. Um, the, the graphics are where they need to be. The gameplay is where it needs to be. Um, the story is where it needs to be. Um, I, I honestly can't wait to see where Ubisoft is going with this. Mm -hmm. um, because they've already pointed out and stated several times that the Assassin's Creed story has an ending. It's already mapped out. They know where they're going. And once they reach the end, it's done. Um, so I, I'm looking forward, uh, in, uh, spoilers, but, uh, pirates are one of the greatest classes that they could have picked for the game. Um, pirates are rogues and rogues are out for their own, mm -hmm. um, which is why the game is the way it is. Um, you play both sides of the fence in this game. Um, uh, for a little bit at least and uh, because of that it, it's intriguing and it makes me want more because I know that somewhere in the storyline you're going to play a straight Templar through the entire game at some point you're going to play the opposite side of the coin for an entire game and it's going to be amazing cool. so I, I can't wait um, but for uh, spoiler-free and spoiler-filled reviews, you can go over to insertcointobegin.com. Um, you're not going to accidentally stumble upon the spoiler-filled review. You uh, buried that, it. You, you did a good I, job burying it. I, I buried the crap out of that game, out of that <laughs> that, that post, um, to the point where you would have to go back. I think two and a half years. <laughs> uh, in, news, wow. in news to even find it you, if you don't click my link well you you're, you're not you're no you're no stranger to this because you used to do secret level posts on your blog before this when you're doing a thousand games yeah yeah it, it's 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 same same tactic uh you just bury it um i think for the secret levels though i put it in like 2000 yeah <laughs> wow. So you're not going to accidentally stumble upon and it's, them. This is a this, um, is this is a WordPress trick on the site that he's doing. Yeah. Here, so, yeah. Um, but yeah, it, unless you click that, it, unless you click the uh, click here button in the story, you're not going to stumble upon it. Yeah. And I even give you time at the beginning of it <laughs> in warning that you're in the the, the spoiler filled review. Uh -huh. So I, I give you so many chances to back out. And it actually got a few hits, um, so people don't care about spoilers. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> and a lot of them, some don't. I mean, it, it, it's a preference, you know. So unless it's, it's also a option. Unless also those people some also people also play might through play... the game. Oh, there is. Oh, I said also some people might have already beaten the game. Like yeah, that's what I was saying. Yeah, wanted your wanted your opinion because you know yeah. your opinion so awesome. We had the same thought at the same time. 
<laughs> it just it was just a, a hangout lag that, yeah. that you didn't sync up. So, how, how's naval combat in it, Chachi? Uh, yes. How it, is belly button combat? It, it's Not fun. It's good. Um, it, it, and like I say, um, the, there's so much to do in the game that you find yourself debating with yourself as to what to improve. Mm-hmm. Uh, you you find yourself with a, a decent amount of coin, and you're like, "Well, do I improve my my person or my fleet?" I'm gonna put a sweet spoiler on this pirate ship. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it, it's like, oh, do I do I need more cannons or uh, do I need more guns on my person? Mm-hmm. Uh, how how is the open worldness of this one? Um, the, uh, the open world kind of aspect uh, of this one. You you spoke. We were speaking the other night uh, over dinner. You were saying uh, about the ship, I, and I know like it sounded like it. It, it, it sounds like it, it. It reminds me of Wind Waker, where you just had this vast open ocean to get from place to place. Uh, you will use the fast travel in this game more than any of the previous games. Okay. Because it's that um, much bigger. Yes. Um, because if you don't, uh, you will spend a good 15 to 20 minutes sailing the ocean, listening to pirate songs um, to get from point A to point B sometimes. Yeah. Have you – I have a question. Have you find? Have you found uh, Moby Dick yet? No. Um, I, I've, heard he's, I've, heard that, I've heard he's in the game. He is in the game um, because of Ubisoft uh, doing away with the paid um, Uplay accounts. Mm-hmm. Um, you're connected to everyone if you're connected to the Uplay server. And uh, that will put daily events on your map, such as naval convoys, which you can loot for a lot of coin, or uh, the Great White Whale, um, Moby Dick. Um, once a day on your so you have to be logged in at the right time, but you can harpoon and capture Mo- Moby Dick. Nice. nice. Um, I haven't done it yet. Um, I, I keep logging on to try, and I keep missing it. Um, it's on Jaws. Yeah, I've captured a great. I've captured like uh, four great white sharks, a couple oh. orcas, um, a few humpback oh. whales. Um, and I will stab the shit out of a jaguar in a heartbeat <laughs> because if you don't, they will kill you. <laughs> like they will destroy you in an instant because they are sneaky, sneaky bastards. Do you have one in your house right now? Oh, I think he's training one of those Call of Duty dogs in the background there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I, man. Uh, ever since I started playing Ghost, uh, Chewie went into uh. Uh, war dog training. Oh, nice! Uh, I have him going through. I have him sneaking through the house. Um, I find myself trying to figure out how I can attach a webcam to Wicket's back. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> GoPro. Well, okay, so um, that brings me to a, a question I had um, for you three two that have played it. Uh, Sork, did you get far enough to control the dog? Yes, yes, I did control did the dog. Did you find? Uh, <laughs> did you find yourself uh, doing everything in your power to make sure that dog didn't get harmed? Y- yes. More so than your Little normal bit. person? A Little bit. No, no, I didn't control him like in multiplayer. Uh, do you control him in multiplayer? I guess not. You just let him go, I think. Um, uh, but in in the campaign, um, yeah, I got like like I, I got him killed a couple times by accident. I kind of felt oh. worse about it. You're like, yeah, you're like, oh, I got killed. And you're like, oh, I got killed. You know, it, 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 this is really an interesting aspect. And it's like, okay, so we're not going to stick our necks out to go shoot that guy or sneak up on him, but we'll send the dog head first at him. Sure, that make okay. That dog can take down a helicopter. <laughs> I didn't get to that part though. <laughs> I didn't get that far. Well, it's in the, yeah, it's in the yeah I did. I did. So. Yes, I did. Um, so, all right. Yeah, well, I, that's a good segue I, I, to I was, our. Oh, I, I found. I found myself. Uh, I didn't. I would like to point out that I did not get the dog killed once. Nice. Me neither. That. That's how careful I was with that damn dog. 
Uh, like there, were, there, were, there were moments, there were moments in this game where I barely moved that dog through the through the high fields, and like I was looking around, I was like, okay, I'm not gonna move this way because I'm gonna get killed there. I'm not gonna kill this go this way because there's no like shade over here, so I'm screwed. And then I just like ever so slightly moved my moved it over. And it was like the scariest moment I've had. <laughs> that dog was is my video game companion. Like it, it, it's my on-screen Chewy. <laughs> like I did that everything dog, in my power to make sure that dog did not get hurt. That dog is my spirit animal. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Awesome. Well, since we're talking about Call of Duty. Um, I wrote an article about the, the top three best and worst maps in all of the Call of Duty so far that I've played. Um, I, I, I didn't play World of War, um, and I didn't play multiplayer for um, the first Modern Warfare. But I did play 2, 3, Black Ops, Black Ops 2. Um, I just want to know what are some of your favorite maps, guys, and your least favorite maps as well. In, in Call of Duty? In Call of Duty, yep. Um, I'm probably the newest one here, but I am a huge fan, and I'm trying to find the equivalent here. I played a little bit of Mosh Pit today to see what Free Fall was like, um, but I like the crazy small maps. Um, yeah. <laughs> the the Nuketown, you know, the nu- Nuketown from the last one, um, the ship, and I kind of like, and I don't know, I can't really kind of dis- define what I like about it, but I really like the aircraft carrier. Um, I like how, you know, it's just this wide open space, you know, um, it's got a really good feel to it. Or these are the ones that I can figure out how to get kills the easiest, I guess. Um, I can't remember what was my favorite on modern warfare. Now that I think about it, it's been so long su- guys. I was surprised on a lot of people's least favorite maps where the aircraft carrier one was on there. Really? Yeah. I, I actually really liked that one. Yeah. And it was on a lot of people's least favorite maps. I was like, geez. So. What about you, Josh? 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 I. uh, The yacht, um, the aircraft carrier, um, Nuketown, and the skate park. Oh, yeah. are, Mm -hmm. Are probably my favorite maps. Um, from Black Ops 2, uh, Dome, um, and, uh, the Dome equivalent in Modern Warfare 3, uh, were probably good ones, or, or are good ones too. Um, well, Dome wasn't then, in Modern Warfare 3. Okay, uh, then Turbine, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Um. Turbine no, was not, another one that made least favorite lists. No, not not Turbine. Uh, uh, terminal. I'm sorry, Terminal. Oh, Terminal. Terminal was really good. That mm-hmm. that actually um, is on my top three. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, and then my least favorite maps. Um, turbine. It, it's just way too big. Um. Uh, and any with snow. <laughs> I hate the snow maps. Yeah, um, yeah. consensus around online. So, it, but uh, I, I'm excited to get in and see the 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 new maps. Um, I I've only played one so far. Oh, the movie lot, uh, the movie studio. That was a good. Oh, that's one a too. good one too. Yeah. Um, I, I, I'm excited to get in and see uh, the maps in Ghost to see if any of them stand out like that. Is there a Vegas map? Because it's in the commercial. I think there is. Okay. Um, I think there is a Vegas map coming out. Riz, what were your, some of your favorites and least favorites? Uh, well, my personal favorite uh, was actually a DLC that, that in the last game. Uh, Vertigo. Oh, oh man. Uh, there was traps everywhere. You can <laughs> fall through the ceiling. You can do... You can, like... Well, you can kill yourself, and you can try like a leap of faith while doing something. Uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff that you can do in that game, and it just in in a map that's so small. There's a lot of things that you can do. Uh, also, oh, 
for my least favorite. I'm gonna, sh- I'm, not, I'm, I'm probably gonna shock some of you guys. I'm not a big firing range guy. I, I didn't like firing range. I can see that. I, I like it better as studio. I, I like it as studio, but but the fact is, I hate when you when you regenerate. You're right in front of somebody who's sniping you from that top ledge, from that from that uh, from that whatever that e- eagle eye is or whatever crow's nest, and just like picking you off. It just bugs me that that's a thing. And that's weird because I do like that map in in studio, but I don't like it in firing range. Cool. All right. Um, as you guys know, um, the legend of this map. I, I know you guys weren't into Modern Warfare Two. You came in a little bit later than that. Um, Rust was my favorite all-time map. Um, it was close quarters combat, just real chaotic. Um, just we 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 would we would wait for this map. Like if somebody was tired and they'd say we'd say one more game, one more game. What if it's Rust? What if it's Rust? It would it, and Rust would come up. They'd stay for even more of the games than, than they were because like just the adrenaline of the game of the map just like boosted everybody's morale. Um, the 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 rules of that map. We had special games when that map would come up. Um, shotguns only, uh, knives hey. only. It, it was awesome. No room for sniping on it. Just real close quarters combat awesomeness. Um, for my least favorite map, um, I went with another, um, Modern Warfare 2 map, uh, called Quarry, which I called Quarry Feldman, (laughs) because it was not fun at all. It, you would wait and wait and wait for somebody to go by just to shoot them with a sniper rifle. And it just took forever to get through that map. Like always, it always went to the time limit. Because there were these giant concrete blocks that were in the way, and you couldn't see anybody. Even if you had a good vantage point, you couldn't see them because they would hide in those little catacombs. It was just the dumbest map. Oh, I hated it. So those are my two. Um, I had two other ones, too, on there. Estate was another hated one I had from Modern Warfare 2. And Outpost, another snow level, uh, was my third least favorite. Um, my three favorites were Rust, um, Nuketown. Uh, from Black Ops 1 and 2. Uh, they brought that one back. And Terminal was number 3 on my top list. So, All right. Uh, I think that's going to do it for our show this week. Um, our challenge this week is Home Alone. You can play it for any system you can find it for. I'm sure you'll hate it on all of them. And, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be wildly different depending on what system you get it on. If yeah. it's anything like the second yeah. one, I'm pretty sure it was just way, way different across across platforms. Mm-hmm. Um, you can sucks. Call, What's that? It's still going to suck. Yeah. Uh, you can follow us on uh, Twitter on at InsertCoinTB. Um, new uh, articles going up daily on InsertCoinToBegin.com. Um, and we have our uh, charity event on InsertCoinToBegin.com. Donate, donate, There's donate, donate. There's a link donate, on the donate, side donate, where you donate, can donate. Donate, 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 um, donate, donate For extra donate. life. We're playing uh, – a lot of the teams went last week, but we're doing ours this week because uh, some scheduling stuff. Um, and we'll probably have a live stream of the Google Hangout. And um, I know a lot of us have the uh, streaming ability, so we're going to be streaming uh, live gameplay as we're playing as well. So uh, watch for that this weekend. Um, I think we're starting around 9 o'clock in the morning, going 10 o'clock on Sunday morning probably. Um, But, yeah, that'll do it for us this week. Uh, Game over. Don't eat.